Hi and welcome to my channel and today we're going to review some products from YesStyle. If you haven't heard about them, YesStyle is a website that sells a variety of products ranging from fashion to makeup and even homeware and most of these items are from Korean brands. Before I begin this video, I want to be completely transparent with you guys. All of the products I'm going to show you today are sponsored by YesStyle. However, with a big exclamation mark, that does not stop me from being brutally honest. If I don't like a product, I will let you know because this is an unbiased review. Now that we got this out of the way, let's go. I ordered 200 euros worth of products, which is a lot, but I tried to cover most of the things that YesStyle sells. So this haul includes fashion, beauty and skincare, and also a few stationary products. Let's start with the clothing pieces. As always, I care a lot about the materials of the fabrics. I try not to buy any polyester or other plastic fabrics because not only are those the ones that tend to look very cheap, I mean, they are cheap, but they're also really bad for the environment. YesStyle sadly isn't the best when it comes to disclosing what materials are being used which made it a little bit difficult to find clothes I can purchase, but I ended up ordering a few very cute things. That's the cheapest to most expensive, and the cheapest item I got was only 5 euros for this cotton camisole top. That was the price when I purchased it, because disclaimer, I've noticed that a few of the items have gotten a little bit more expensive. But back to the top, I was so excited for this, and when I opened it up, it felt a little bit off. And that's because in the pictures, the lining and the stitching looked like they were the same color, but they obviously aren't. I'm sorry, the microphone is pretty far away, so I hope the audio is fine, but I'm currently in the process of buying an external mic, so it will be better next time, I promise. As for the top, I think this one looks a lot better when it's actually worn, but I'm still a little mad that it's not the same as the picture. Apart from that, I honestly think that this is a really cute top. Let me show you the back. It also came with this removable bra thingy, but I'm not using it because I'm honestly not feeling very comfortable with big boobs. But all in all, I would say that this is definitely worth the 5 euros. I think it's very cute, it's also super comfy, and I'm actually thinking about checking out the other colors as well. Next we have this cute crop tank top, which was around 8 euros when I purchased it. And let me tell you, this thing ripped the first time I tried it on. It just it ripped. This is a one size and I know that Korean one size can be a little bit crazy but I already owned a few one size items from YesStyle and they've never been a problem. For reference, I'm normally a size extra small to small but this one, it's very tight around the arms where it ripped which makes me so sad because this would be the perfect basic top for summer. Here it is and it obviously would be a very cute top. I think it's the perfect basic piece. But let's take a look at the rib. So here's the normal side and it's quite tight around the arm. It's a little bit uncomfortable but manageable. And here is the broken side. As you can see, it is not that tight anymore. <laughs> it ripped that much. That is like three to four centimeters, so not even a small bit. I'm very lucky that I have a handy mom who's going to sew this for me. But that shouldn't be necessary. So I could only recommend this top if you're really, really small and even then, the quality is not that good. I mean, it did just rip. And also, if you have bigger boobs than me, which is not difficult, this is not a top for you. It will be too tight. For the next one, I might have cheated a little, or I don't know if it's cheating, you tell me. It's this cardigan in this super cute springish blue color. And I actually already own this one in beige. I got this a couple of years ago, but it was so cute. I had to get it in a different color as well. And I think this one was about 19 euros. I think these kind of tops are the perfect staple pieces. If you don't know what to wear, just style them with a cute pair of jeans and a skirt and boom, you look nice. And I love the cut of it. I think the neckline is perfect for layering necklaces. And given the fact that I bought a beige one way over a year ago and it's still doing fine, speaks for the quality. However, it does have some negative aspects. I think the sleeves could be a little bit longer and this is another one size piece. It is pretty stretchy and I've read through the reviews and it seems to be fitting nicely up to a size medium. But be warned, as I said, Korean one size can be a little bit crazy. Next up is the piece I was most excited about. It's this cardigan in the colorway metallic gray for 26 euros. It's definitely on the more expensive side of the haul, although I think 26 euros for a cardigan is still pretty good. But, and there is a but, I chose a medium. It was only available in either small or medium. And I chose the medium because I wanted it to be a little bit oversized. 
it's not. This one definitely isn't as oversized as I hoped it would be, but it's still very cute. I think the black details make it look a little bit bougie, but I definitely prefer wearing this opened on top of something. It's also really comfortable and the material feels a lot more high quality than most of the SL pieces I own. So this is definitely a recommendation, but make sure to size up. Next up, we have another cardigan. I just noticed I ordered a lot of cardigans. I'm sorry, I just love them. And this one has these cute details on the seams as well as some Oh, I hope you can see them, as well as some um, fake pearl buttons. This one was also around 27 euros, I think, and I actually can't complain. I think this one is really cute and the fabric also feels good. I think this one will look cute both ways, so either as a top on its own or a button as a layer. But I do have one small downside to this one. I prefer my sleeves to be a little bit longer. I think these are pretty short. But apart from that, I think it's a pretty cute piece. And if I remember correctly, it's also available in a different color. I just noticed that I made a mistake because I actually ordered a cheaper clothing item. So these pair of socks were actually the cheapest item I got and they were 1 euro and 70 cents I think and, and just look at them They came in a lot of different fruit options to choose from and I went with the banana and it literally just reads banana in Japanese Amazing and that concludes the clothing part of this video, so let's move on to stationery I only got a few stationery products and I'm really proud of that because I had a difficult time choosing. Everything was so cute and I could have easily spent the entire 200 euros on stationary products alone, but I tried to contain myself. So the first thing I got is this washi tape and I hate that they put this barcode sticker on top of the pretty packaging. <laughs> Why? Let me just check if I can pull it off. Okay, at least it was easy to... Oh my god. You got lucky this time, yes, sir. Let's open it up. I hope you can see the motif. If not, I'm going to put in the picture from Yes Style. But this is like a scenery at a river. It's really pretty and they had a lot of beautiful motifs to choose from. It's a really nice tape, just a little bit smaller than I expected it to be. Why? Yes Style, please. So these are actually little stickers that look like stamps. No. <sighs> Let me show you. Oh no. I already lost one. <laughs> and I think these are prints by Hoxai. Yes, I think all of them are by Hoxai. As you can see, they look like this and they are so cute. Look at them. So yeah, this one's really cute. I love it. I forgot to mention the prices, but I will put it on the screen somewhere. Another pack of stickers. I think these are Chinese writings. Let me check. Yeah, so these are Chinese writings. They are so aesthetic. They come in this gold metallic look and they are so beautiful. If you're journaling and you want to make it look aesthetic, definitely get those. And last but not least, I got two packs of sticky notes. This one's actually from a friend. She's just as crazy about stationery as I am, so I hope she'll love it. And this one, can you guess why I got this one? Look at it. Does it remind you of a movie with vampires and werewolves? I literally got this because it was giving me Twilight vibes. I don't know. I think it's given forks, 10 out of 10. <laughs> now onto the skincare and makeup portion of this video. And I know that a lot of people are obsessed with Korean skincare, so am I. But I've honestly never been the biggest makeup and skincare expert. But I recently really got into Korean skincare, so I've been trying to learn more about it. So I got a little bit of help from TikTok to choose these products. So first up we have the COSXR, COSXR, I don't know how to pronounce this one. They're clarifying treatment toner and I've been using this one for the last couple of weeks and I honestly gotta say that I'm not sure it's doing that much for my skin. I think I definitely prefer the Anua 77% hard leaf toner. I think it's working better on my skin but I guess it's just a preference because I know that a lot of people absolutely love this one. Next up we have the Pyongan Your Eye Cream. And was my decision to buy this product strongly influenced by the design of the packaging? Yes, absolutely. And you might not be impressed right now, but let me open this up. I saw this one and immediately added to cart because it comes in a tin. Look how pretty it is. You already know I love stationery and I will 100% use this for pencils as soon as I'm done with the cream. <laughs> this is what the eye cream looks like and I honestly gotta say I haven't tried it because this is one of those things that is just it's too pretty to try. Yesel also included a little tester for the Santella ampoule which I know is super popular and I think it's great that they included this 
because I also got it. So if you've been on TikTok, you've definitely heard about this one. It's been really popular and the store in Korea seems to be so, so beautiful. And I can confirm this one is so good. It's so refreshing on the skin and it has helped me a lot with irritation. So I definitely recommend trying it. Next up, we have the Rosemary Sculpt Scaling Shampoo by Aromatica. And this one is a lifesaver. I have really thin hair and I've been looking for a good shampoo that gives me volume without making my hair look frizzy. And this one is it. It is amazing. I've been using this one in combination with the Fino hair mask. So great. So if you want more volume in your hair, get this one, please. Try it out. I also got these lip tints. The first one is by Etude and it's actually the one I'm wearing right now. I actually really love the color, but this one is sadly not very long lasting because normally lip tints or inks are supposed to stay on for three to six hours, but I definitely need to reapply this one every hour or even sooner if I eat or drink something. I also chose a similar color for the Ink Velvet by Perdi Perda and I really love the packaging. But let me try it on. So this is the number 17. I really love this kind of colors. This one feels a little bit more smoother and I think it's also longer lasting than the one by Etude. So the last one is by Rom End and it's the color Chuchu Bay. It's a little bit more reddish than the other ones, but let's put it on. So this one is definitely the glossiest out of all the ones I've tried. This one feels very light and I really love the color, but out of all the ones I've tried, I definitely recommend the Patty Perda. I think this one is the most comfortable on the lips and I think it also stays on for the the longest. That concludes my Yes Style haul. I hope you enjoyed it. I linked all of the products I showed you today in the description down below. And again, I want to be very transparent. I use affiliate links, so if you happen to order something through my link or with my code BeGlorious10, I will get commission, which helps me out to make even more videos. Thank you so much for watching and I hope I'll see you next time. Bye bye!